Hey guys, it's me, Sean. I'm making a vlog, and I don't know why. But, since I'm bored this whole week, since Ashley's off to Florida, because she's on vacation, yeah. But, as you can tell, I got a haircut, and my long hair is not covering my face anymore. But if I actually notice that, um... Me with a haircut sort of makes me look a little bit younger. But also, I dyed the tips of my hair. So it goes from my natural hair color to a brighter brown, as you can tell. And I honestly don't know how it looks in the back because Ashley did it yesterday. So I'll give you a shot of it so I can look at it as soon as I get off of this stupid freaking video. Wait, but let's see if you can get a shot of my head. Uh, maybe not in the light. Okay. Can you see it? Cause I can't. But, um, yeah, so besides having my new haircut and the dyeing of my tips in it, um, I got an ear pierce. So, yeah, I just got in bed about Thursday, so I'm cleaning it in that. And then, once I... Once it's done healing in that, then I'm gonna get... I'm gonna put a 16 gauge in in that. So, yeah, that's gonna be awesome, isn't it? Oh, yo, check out my new freaking shirt. It's a freaking grill, but it's an MTV shirt, so it's gonna be awesome. And also, uh... Oh, yeah, so I learned something earlier. Where did my bottle go? Oh, there it is. All right, try and figure out what this is. What's this? It's not iced tea. It's not flavored water. It's got foam and stuff in it. Yeah, that's right. It's Alka Monster. It's Monster. That popped a little bit more than I thought it would. I put it in the bottle since cans. Well, I'm not carrying a can up in the room because if it spills, I'm screwed. Because we don't know if monster stains. But anyway, so... Yeah, I usually would spike my hair, but I didn't spike it today. Might have got the haircut Thursday, but I did spike it for the past couple of days. But today I didn't spike it because, well, I'm feeling kind of bummish. If you can tell, I'm still in my PJs. Because <laughs> I really haven't done anything today. But I'm going to sing it off because I promised my friend that I, I'd go and play Xbox with him. Well, Ashley's brother. That I'd go play Xbox. And that. So... Yeah, like, my new ear piercing, it's gonna be freaking awesome, I can't wait to wear other crap in it. Cause I don't wanna just wear the one stud all the freaking time, so, can't wait to get more. But yeah, I'm not like those people who get the two piercings and they're like, oh look at me, I'm just a little fag. No, I'm just gonna have the one piercing. Do not look sexy. No, not really. I'm not the sexy type. But yeah, so I'd usually like, spike the top, like my middle. And it'd go from here. And go all the way back. And then it would go with my work uniform. Wanna know where I work? Hold on, one freaking second. Okay. You wanna see where I work? Right there. McDonald's. I'm a big happy man. But anyway, I'll let you all go, and I'm going to go go play some Xbox and that. So, cause well, I kind of promised Ashley I'd do that too, because well, you know, I'm not allowed to sit up in the room and be antisocial for a whole week. So I gotta go do something. But I still can't believe how my hair is. It's like. My friend, uh, he thought, because was it? We asked him last night if, um, if he liked how my hair was, and he was like, 
Honestly, I liked how your hair was before with the black. I was like, my hair was never black. It was dark, dark brown. So, I'm awesome like that. So, apparently my hair is black. And my hair is naturally straight. The only thing that it does do is my hair goes over like that for the natural emo flippy hair. So, and honestly, I gotta say, getting your hair cut by a gay guy is the most fun experience ever. He, he is my now preferred hairstylist. I'm going to go to him every time I want a haircut, and he's going to cut it. I'm going to have him cut it. It's freaking amazing. And he also told me that never work with women. Just never. <laughs> so I don't know what I'm going to do in the future because I work with women right now. But yeah, he's my preferred stylist now. And he's so great at doing like the emo type cuts and the punk cuts and all that because that's how he wants his hair, so he's great at it. But, um... I'm gonna let you all go now, so, yeah, peace, a late bro, huh?